Boy, this game's inconsistency with, like, full caps is really starting to annoy me. Will you take the residence map? Will you take the residence oh, key? Oh, I forgot to grab the red book. Oh, for God's sakes. <laughs> Sorry. Wait, what is red book? Red book is a thing, right? It actually sounds like pornography. Red book? Yeah, that's a thing, right? Isn't that that, uh... It's like that rental thing? Oh, that's red box. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, red book. Canadian red book vehicle valuation guide. Okay. Okay, not a thing I have any interest in. Never mind, that's not funny. I thought I was so sure when you started talking that you were going to start talking to me about Green Book and I was going to be able to dunk on you so hard for your colorblindness for some reason extending to words and not just colors. Thankfully, it's, Alas, it was not to be. It's not that bad. Oh, damn it. You, we still got that fucking blue gemstone, huh? Uh, yeah, that... Oh, God. Is that, like, an endgame thing? Um, an Avengers endgame thing? That's one of the Infinity Stones. It's mid-game. Okay. I thought we... Are uh, we not mid-game already? Uh, we're kind of mid-game. This and the second mansion segment, they're all kind of mid-game. By second mansion, do you mean we go to a new mansion, or we just go back to the mansion? We go back to oh, the... Oh, thank God. I couldn't stand a whole new mansion. I know. I, I was going to throw my mic stand across the room. I have a hard enough time getting through the main mansion. Yeah. And this place, apparently. So it would seem. Well, not so much I have a hard time getting through it. I have a hard time remembering what I need to get through it. Adventure games. I like how she's she's like, I wonder if these tools are used to do some sort of experiment when they're like alchemist materials. And they're also roped off, so very clearly they're for display. It's the gallery that we're in. Yeah, but she's like, were they used for an experiment? Like, yeah, trying to turn lead into gold or some shit. That was a little deer statue there. That's okay. Adorable. What's up with the, what's up, Perspective? Okay, I'm just, Jesus. we have enough ink ribbon. Wait, an ink ribbon. Yeah, fuck, get the ink ribbon. So, uh. For fucking game. give me the controller. For this part. I'm going to get the fucking ink ribbon. Oh. Bondage with blood. So I think VPC present. Yay, more notes. Oh, organic chemistry lab experiment. The similarities in the cellular characteristics of the rapidly growing plant infected by the Tyrant virus have been reported in previous papers. However, while repeating these experiments, an interesting new fact became clear. We learned that a chemical in the UMB family, UMB number 20, contains a compound that is toxic to the cells of the plant. We have given UMB number 20... This music and me ringing it makes it sound like Rod Sterling. <laughs> We have given UMB number 20 a new name, V... V-Jolt. I don't know why that's... <laughs> I don't know why that gave me pause. If calculations prove correct, when V-Jolt is applied directly to the root of the plant, the entire plant should be dead within five seconds. The V-Jolt can be made by simply mixing the VP and UMB chemicals in a specific ratio. However, extra care must be taken when handling these UMB chemicals. They have been known to generate toxic gases if handled. The characters of each UMB chemical are as follows. Do I have to write this down? I got a picture of it. Okay. Yeah. Ugh. UMB number 3, red, yellow, 6, yellow. UMB number 7, green. UMB number 10, orange. VP 17, blue. V jolt, dark brown. Again, V jolt screws me up for some reason. Oh, you already got a picture of it? Uh, yeah, I've already okay. got a picture of it. The space between the books catches your attention. Let's use the red book. Alright. And now we gotta That's rearrange That's not them. right. Oh, wait, how's the selector gonna be in this? Uh, you select one book, and uh -huh. then you select another one to swap Okay, with. it's not gonna be like... Like, go to your inventory. Use book one. Thankfully, no. Ugh. So I'm just gonna... Wait a minute. This is creating an image that does not seem family-friendly to me. No, uh... This seems decidedly unwholesome. We might have to censor this. Pornographic. That's a nipple. That's a nipple I can see right there. Yep. You're right. You're correct. I'm just... Dis I'm disgusted. Uh, all that... All that zombie killing we've been doing, hey. but this is just unacceptable. We're not going through that door yet. Yes, yeah, like um, because the media is really weird and they're fine with violence, but not with nudity. Like, yeah, yeah have some dude get like shot sixteen times in the chest in a cop drama, but we can't show a little titty. That's too much. Think of the children. Again with draining bathtubs. <laughs> There's something in the bathtub. Of course, there's always something in the bathtub. 
dagger. There's always money in the banana stand. I still haven't seen season five. Have you seen any of it? No, I haven't. Uh, I haven't seen the redux of season four that's either. Pr- I, I don't feel... I, I gotta watch season five before I watch that because I've already seen at least season four of the Ridge. We were uh, talking about this in our Fae playthrough. Um, I don't know which one's gonna come up first, but... I might even make it a simultaneous release. Yeah. Just in case people... What were we talking about before? It doesn't matter. What were we talking about before? In the Faith playthrough. Um, Arrested Development? Yeah. We oh, talking... I thought you had some addendum to those thoughts. Well, it's just like, you brought up the Redux, and yeah. I didn't know about it at the time. Oh. It'd be weird. It's like, oh, I know <laughs> about it now, and then in a later video... Listen, time is a flat circle. Okay. Yeah. That's a show I need to watch more of as well. True Detective. I've only seen the first season. So, uh, those chemicals, we gotta go into... Was I supposed to be remembering those? Sorry, I'm, I just don't care. Oh, God. Okay. So, uh, for this... So, do I need both numbers? Uh, this is the orange one. I just need the... I, uh, sorry, what color is it? Amber. Thank you. <laughs> Four, five. So, we wanna hit five... And then for this one, it's two six. And then two three. Why do we need both numbers? I don't think we did. Oh well. What the fuck's the matter with you? <laughs> it was just the order of the lamps that we saw. Uh, oh wait, there was no reason for any. Ah, oh, fuck this game. There was no reason for any of that. So those. Ah, oh, you. F- I'm so angry at you right now. I'm so angry about you making me figure out, oh, this thing's got two lines coming off of it, so it doesn't mean jack shit. I'm so angry at you. What's that written on the wall? For a good time, call. Sure. Yeah. Umb number three. Yellow six. That's my favorite food coloring. Okay, apparently it's nitric acid. Yes. All right. So we're doing some chemistry. Great. Just mix up any old thing you find. Ooh, free free pills. Awesome. You know what I always say? What? If a stranger offers you free drugs, just take them because they're expensive. Sure. That sounds like sound <laughs> advice. It's never done me wrong before. Whoops. Whoops. Oh, it's not necessary? What if Jill is thirsty? Yeah. You son of a bitch. Don't even care about her feelings. Do you um, know what you're doing here? I I need to Okay. I need to look up the order, because I think if I mix them wrong, I probably damage myself. Right. Wait, you have to drink it? Oh no, right. If it's mishandled, they if you manhandle a, the chemicals. Makes a poisonous gas. Oh, so it's just bleach and ammonia. No. <laughs> yes, I do want to play. You know, Resident I could have just taken a picture of it, right? That would have been easier than trying to Google it. Yeah, but it doesn't tell you uh, how to mix certain ones. What? Like, it doesn't tell you because uh, eventually you're going to get to the point where it's like chemical to use on plants. Chemical? Oh, not. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are making that <laughs> technically, but this is V Jolt. That sounds like a new Gatorade flavor. Yeah. Gatorade V Jolt. Unleash the V Beast. We uh we may cut this part out if I take too long. What? You're gonna cut out my hilarious Gatorade V Jolt goo? <laughs> no, I'll leave that in. That's so funny. That's comedy gold. That's literally the funniest thing I've said this whole playthrough. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure I'm sure there's another gem in there. No. Okay, here we go. Alright. You want me to read it? Yes, and I think I did the first two parts. So you... Okay, so add yellow 6 to a bottle and combine with NP004 to make UNB10. Add yellow 6 to a bottle. Yellow 6, okay. Uh, Is this the yellow 6? Yes. We'll take some. Combine with UNP004 to make UNB10. Okay. Add yellow six to another bottle and combine it with water to make UMB seven. I think I've got that already. Is that the green one? UMB seven. 
That yes, is okay. One. Combine the UMB ten and UMB seven to make VP seventeen. Christ, this is brutal. Got it. Finally, fill another bottle with UMB three and combine it with VP seventeen. Which one's UMB three? Okay. That's fine. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, combine UMB3 with VP17, and that should be it. How are you supposed to figure this out on your own? This is brutal. There I know. Go. There we go. We got the Vigil. V Vigils. So now we got to backtrack to the Aqua Ring. What's the Aqua Ring? Oh, that's where the sharks were. Yeah. And then what do you have to do? We have to, um, there's another room there that we, um, We pour the chemicals into? Well, we release them. We release the chemicals. The chemicals into the water supply. Nope, into uh, you'll see. Into the plant. Into yeah. the. I was gonna. Oh, into the spray bottle. Uh, nope. Into uh, the spritzer. Remember they into said the spritzer. The seltzer. The spritzer. I prefer seltzer. Ugh. Have you ever had real seltzer water? It's terrible. Uh, like, just I usually make my own. I have a soda stream. What's it like living in the bourgeoisie, you fucking swine? <laughs> Ooh, look at me. Look at me, I'm in the 1%, you fucking swine. Whoops. Didn't need to go there. <laughs> no response, huh? Uh, Just like you rich folk. Why don't you, why don't you hire someone to give me an insult, give me a clap back? I have a lot of misplaced anger. Well, actually not misplaced anger towards the upper class. I would say a lot of righteous anger against the upper class. Yeah, they live a little too decadently, some of them. They say you should eat the rich, but if you eat parasites, you get sick. Hey! I almost definitely said that before. I think you did. Not I, in one of our playthroughs. It's been but... a... Okay, whatever. Uh, it's been a while since we last recorded, so... Uh, does this count as getting political? No. Okay. Well, you love glorious communism, right? It's more of a way of life. Yeah. Yeah, no, I guess it's not so. political. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go with that. <laughs> uh, why didn't she just slide down the ladder? This is as bad as Alan Wake. I don't know. Because. Loading screen. It'd be over too quickly. <laughs> Just make the ladder longer, then. That's probably a long ladder. Do you know what misophonia is? Uh, that's like a negative reaction to certain sounds, right? Yeah, it's an ingrained, it's like a, it's a disorder, and like a certain sound, like chewing or grinding teeth or snapping and stuff, creates not just like, oh, I'm annoyed this dude's doing the thing. It creates like a blind anger within a person. A lot of these footfall effects are kind of doing that to me right now. For some reason, I just really can't fucking stand them. Well, if there was, if there was something I could do about that, I would, but... Can't you just T-pose and, like, slide through the whole game? <laughs> no, this isn't, uh... T-posing will never not be funny to me. I don't care how dumb and played out it is. Um, this isn't, uh, Miles Morales in, uh, uh, the Spider-Man game. Apparently a lot of people had that exact thing happened to them yeah so it was up on uh, youtube that's great oh, i love completely that completely kills the tone oh, but it is the wonderful. dramatic tension is ruined when he t-poses and hovers over some rubble and it's completely invincible while doing so yep that game's pretty good i should actually go and finish it so hey i've seen this hand time before <laughs> i think we already made that i joke. don't care this one's way more so And I just saved us a boss fight. All right. Uh, if you're Chris, do you have to fight that boss? I don't remember. Because Chris is a dumb dumb who doesn't know how to mix chemicals. Maybe. Probably. I don't know. Maybe wouldn't he wouldn't put it past him. Maybe he gets Rebecca to do it for him. Rebecca's all medical and chemicals and stuff. She probably And she knows. has a, like a cowboy outfit, too, which is very funny. Oh, yeah, she does. <laughs> Oh, um, I looked up uh, some of the other costumes you get in this game. Uh -huh. I love the um, the casual Chris with the toque and the sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> Hipster Chris. Just completely out of... Is he wearing sweats? 
I think he is wearing nice. sweats. Oh, he's got he's wearing joggers so he can show off those fucking Jordans. Because he's a sneakerhead, I guess. Sure. I... Chris does not strike me as a sneakerhead. Rebecca, I could see. Yeah. She's young, though. Not like Chris is an old man, either. <laughs> she seems younger. He's... Chris is especially pretty young in this game. How old is he supposed to be? I don't know. Okay. But he looks very young. Looks can be deceiving. I get carded all the time at the liquor store, and I'm 26. No response, huh? Well, I think it's yeah. just... I was trying to... I think they just do that with everybody that's under 30. Shut up. I get carded. <laughs> yeah, but you definitely look young. Yeah. Like young, young. And I'm an old man. Sure. I'm older than you. An old man of 20... soon to be 26. Eh, it's close enough. It's basically my birthday already. Yeah. I had to think about it the other day. Someone asked me how old I was going to be, and I had to think about it for a second. I've, I'm officially that old where I'm not entirely certain how old I am. I always made fun of, uh, of a friend of mine for never being able to figure out how old he is. Now I'm feeling it. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going... We're going into that door. Man, we've been in this place for a while. Where are we just in the underground? Like the underground facility? Um, well that was one of them. Hmm. There's another one that we'll get to. No, that was my daughter's play pool with the giant fucking zombie sharks in it. Hey, it's Mother Brain. I've definitely fought this boss in Metroid Prime. Don't worry, this is supposed to happen. I'm not the one playing, so I'm not that worried anyways. What hey, what's the up hell here? is this thing? Where did you get a flamethrower from? It's Barry. He found it during Barry time. <laughs> Careful, I think you just turn you sideways and suddenly you murdered Jill. Yeah. I mean, I know it's like the heat of the moment and everything, but that may not have been a safe it's move. It's the heat of the night. Feel the beat of the rhythm. There you go. I thought it was finished. Was it good for you? Yeah. That was the most. That was the, the most exciting very time close. ever. Thanks again. Don't mention oh. it. Fucked up subtitles. But what was that? What the hell's going on in this place? You already know. You are dealing with whiskers. Does Barry appear in other games? Like uh, as a playable character? Yeah, I think we mentioned Zoom in a three. we mentioned in an earlier episode he's in uh, Revelations two. Oh yes, I remember that. And he plays his daughter at one point, I think. Sure. Now we can open every place in the mansion. The one he's betraying everyone to protect. Barry. 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 Something about that mansion <laughs> still bothers me. Like I'll it's full of room. zombies. That's what's bothering me. Up again and investigate. All right. Okie doke. All right. All right. Back to the back to the mansion. Something that this game has reminded me of, and isn't really related to anything. But I remember reading Archie comics a lot as a kid. Uh huh. And in Archie comics, if a sentence didn't end with a question mark, it always ended with an exclamation point. Oh, yeah. What's up with that? I don't know. Or sometimes I guess it would end with an ellipsis, but like generally every sentence was ended with an exclamation mark. I guess everybody in Riverdale just loves yelling. Really everything. like shouting at each other. Oh, that's it. Barry's. Wesker. Oh, it's Whiskers. Jill. I mean, haven't seen so you in safe. a while. That's what I was going to say. You were going to say Jill, so you're safe? That's all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. I understand. Anyway, Zombies. It's good that you're safe. Did you notice? Barry. He's, he's still wearing his sunglasses now like a prick. It, yeah. I'll keep a close hey, eye. Where's the sunglasses at night? Under Ugh. The circumstances. It's not really our standard operation. 
Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. I agree. Whatever, nerd. There are still rooms in what that. What the fuck did you just say to me? <laughs> up. I've been looking for ways to Okay, if there's get in anything, on some I'll go berry to the other mansion. I'm counting on you. Ah, so Wesker likes to join in on berry time, I see. This is part of my fan fiction. There's gonna be an AR at or a yeah, an AR app tie-in with this video series, and it's gonna have uh, little segments that you can click on to access my fanfiction, my Wesker X Barry fanfiction. And uh, in the Hyperlight Drifter playthrough, we'll have the uh, edgy, edgy Drifter series where uh... I never got that costume though. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. I got a lot of herb. I you got probably... a lot of shit in this box that just keeps teleporting. I should I should probably mix some together. You can, yeah, you could, I don't know, you could probably afford to bring some along with you at some point. It's just I always have to... Oh, but you're a fucking, you've been speedrunning this shit. <laughs> sure. Do a shield bomb skip. So why is the brown one better than the other ones? Cause it uh, it's a full heal and it cures poison. Ah, and does poison kill you over time? I think so. Yeah. Mm. So you could just get poisoned and be hooped for the rest of the game. Also, can you reload your shotgun? It's been driving me crazy. Oh yeah, I can do that. Thank you. I know it has absolutely nothing to do with anything, but it's been driving me nuts. I'm actually gonna switch back also, to my. Also, maybe reload your pistol too. All right. We're doing some... Ah, uh, the classic combine. <laughs> you, <laughs> you combine gun and ammunition to create gun with ammunition. So I think I'm going to save at this point because uh, when we go back to the mansion, that's when a certain, uh, certain beefy boys start to come into play. Is that the hunters? Yep. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my god, I didn't realize I had this many shotgun shells. I should really just use the rest of the shells in my yeah, regular Yeah, sorry, shotgun. I wasn't paying attention. How many shotgun shells do you have? I've got, uh, all together, it would be 30. Oh, that's not... Okay, well, compared to 141, that's <laughs> well, not that much. You don't need as many shotgun shells to kill an enemy, not though. I guess, so but you also don't need 141 rounds to kill everything in this game. I'm just gonna save my progress before we go back to the mansion. 